Hello everyone and welcome back to my new video. You are watching Quaint Tech HD and now let's get in this video. What do mechatronics engineers actually do? It turns out you may be more familiar with mechatronics than you think. The combination of mechanical and electrical engineering with computer programming, mechatronics is increasingly, and we bet you've heard of some of these famous inventions that have only become possible through mechatronics, unique combination of skills. Number 10. Sophia the Robot Developed by Hansen Robotics, Sophia is one of the most famous robots in the world for interactions with people based on artificial intelligence. She's become an ambassador for AI, with their creators exploring and pushing the boundaries of that new technology every day. But did you know that Sophia also uses mechatronics to operate? She moves, talks, and needs power to run in addition to that famous computer brain. According to her, I have IK solvers and path planning for controlling my hands, gaze, and locomotion strategy. My walking body performs dynamic stabilization for adaptive walking over various terrain. Sophia's social skills would be less impressive if she didn't understand that she could look at you by tilting her head, or that she could move her mouth according to the timing of her speech. Number 9. NASA's Curiosity Rover. In some sense, the Mars Science Laboratory rover's parts are similar to what any living creature would need to keep it alive and able to explore, says NASA. They describe Curiosity as having a computer brain, a battery and power for energy, and wheels for mobility. It can also move its arm and hand to collect samples and analyze its environment and communicate with NASA back on Earth with further instruments on board. Many astronautic projects employ mechatronics engineering as well, from robots on other planets to probes and satellites. If it moves, needs power, and is directed by a computer, it's mechatronics. Anti-Log Braking Systems, or ABS, or ABS, work via sensors that detect the speed of your wheels in addition to an algorithm that tells the car when your wheels are turning faster even though you are trying. When your wheels lock up, the ABS activates and tries to keep your wheels from skidding while you slow down. It lets you continue to able to steer the car while it helps you stop. How the stuff works says, the ABS controller knows that such a rapid deceleration is impossible, so it reduces the pressure to that brake until it sees an acceleration. Then it, then it increases the pressure until it sees the deceleration again. It can do this very quickly, before the tire can actually significantly change speed. Number 7. Eye Limb Biomechatronics is a newer field, but a fascinating one. Mechatronics engineers are making machines to support or in the case of a loss to replace a natural functions of the human body. One of the most sophisticated examples of this today is eye limb, a prosthetic hand with bionic components to aid amputees. In a break. Eye limb uses sensors placed on the wearer's skin that allow them to control the movement of the hand and fingers through muscle signals. Each finger has its own motor so that wearers can move every part of the hand in a way that mimics the body's natural motor control. Number 6. The CNC Machine CNC machine or computer numerical control devices manipulate shop tools to help users build prototypes. Typically, users use a software to tell the CNC machine what to do. For example, a mechanic, engineer, or blacksmith might use CAD to draw up a design they want to cut out of sheet metal and the CNC machine will cut that shape precisely. Woodworkers can use CNC machines to help them shape wood-based projects or to engrave or etch special designs. Number 5. Roomba The Roomba might be the only robot on this list that you've actually seen in person. This hugely popular little vacuum was designed by Joe Jones in collaboration with Jack Schmick and originally hit home in 2002. That's when it was released by iRobot. Several different upgraded versions of the Roomba have been released since, and it only seems to be getting more popular as time goes by. Who wants to vacuum their house when a little robot could do it for you? The Roomba works by using a combination of computer algorithms, sensors, and a three-pong spinner brush designed to help snag dirt even out of square corners. It has two motorized wheels which can move independently of one another to let the Roomba turn a full circle in place. Number 4. Robotic arms for automation. Not to be confused for number 4 on this list, these robotic arms can come in sizes bigger than you are. Mechatronic engineers are in high demand in the manufacturing industry where devices like robotic arms are being used on factory floor assembly lines to lift and assemble big parts that are too heavy for people. The automotive industry frequently uses these arms to help assemble cars, for example. Besides just helping with tasks like heavy lifting or material removing, besides just helping with tasks like heavy lifting or material removal, robotic arms can also to make precision tasks more accurate and efficient. The task of welding, for example, is being moved away from human workers and more frequently placed in the steely claws of these robots. Number 3. Blex Exoskeleton 
Funded by DARPA, the Blex or Berkeley Lower Extremity Exoskeleton was cooked up in the UC Berkeley's Human Engineering and Robotics Laboratory in the year 2000. Blex is another example of biomechatronics acting as a wearable system to increase the lifting capacity of a normal human. It was designed to aid soldiers, first responders, disaster relief workers, firefighters, and other emergency personnel with carrying critical supplies without getting weighed down or exhausted. Berkeley writes, while wearing the exoskeleton, the wearer can carry significant loads over considerable distances without reducing his or her agility, thus significantly increasing his or her physical effectiveness. In order to address issues of field robustness and reliability, the system is designed such that should the device lose power, the exoskeleton legs can be removed with the machine becoming no more than a standard backpack. The Blex has a power unit contained in the backpack area to which users can attach or detach in an emergency. The anthropomorphic legs, while its original purpose was military in nature, the Blex has other potential applications including assisting people with lower extremity or spinal injuries with mobility issues. Number 2. Boston Dynamics Big Dog The robots coming out of the Boston Dynamics right now are straight out of 3020. You've probably seen their famous quadrupedal robot spot. Before Spot was a twinkle in the Boston Dynamics team's eyes, there was Project Big Dog. Big Dog was the first robot from Boston Dynamics to have legs. It was a major milestone for their team mechanically and used sensors and a unique control system to navigate rough terrain. Originally designed for military use in 2004, Big Dog was just a little too noisy to make the cut, but fortunately led the team to explore the use of legs in other robotics projects. Number 1. Tesla's Autopilot Many modern cars incorporate iOS or computer technology to help you get around. But nobody does it quite like Tesla. Tesla vehicles are in and of themselves amazing from both an electrical and mechanical engineering stance. We could dedicate a whole article by itself to Tesla's revolutionary battery technology, but their self-driving technology is nothing short of cutting edge. It's hard to describe it any better than Tesla's autopilot site. It's hard to describe it any better than Tesla's autopilot site. All you will need to do is get in and tell your car where to go. If you don't say anything, the car will look at your calendar and take you there as the assumed destination or just home if nothing is on the calendar. Your Tesla will figure out the optimal route, navigate urban streets, manage complex intersections with traffic lights, stop signs and roundabouts, and handle densely packed freeways with cars moving at high speed. When you arrive at your destination, simply step out of the entrance and your car will enter park seek mode. Automatically search for a spot and park itself. Their cars auto steer navigate traffic amidst the unpredictability of human drivers and have a feature that allows you to summon the car to you like the tech wizard you are. But self-driving cars just don't have to be the street smart. The computer has to tell them everything from how to move or pump the brake to how much power to use the accelerate to a specific speed. The electrical and mechanical pieces of the Tesla have to constantly communicate and work in conjunction with a car's computer in order to make the autopilot possible, making Tesla a mechatronics pioneer. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Which of these inventions do you think is your favorite or you'd like to have? Let us know in the comment section below, don't forget to subscribe, see you next time.